we play. We fight. We conquer. Welcome back to The Freak Show. I'm your host, Bumpy McSquiggums, and today we are diving back into Legend of Heroes, Trails of Cold Steel. We have a lot of people to talk to here in the old marketplace. Uh, before we do any of that, let's go see if we can't do... Let's see if we can't do some uh, cooking. Some cooking, some service, and some delicious thing. I don't know where we do that at. I don't remember. Huh. It's here. Okay. That looks like our... Okay. And now we actually have people with us. We can probably do all three. And it looks like... Elliot's probably the best person to do that with. Alright, let's, let's, let's okay. do that. Let's see. I don't know if we're getting any like bonding points for it. <laughs> this is my specialty. Got some warm egg soup. And he had a little king thing on top, so I'm assuming it's probably the best thing that we could do. It cures freeze, it gives us 600 HP, which is the same as a simple omelet. And it gives us additional strength, so more damage. Versus the solid omelet, giving us more defense. Okay. Well, I mean, that's something. I don't know that our bonding went up at all for that, but that's okay. Didn't have to. All right, let's talk to people. Huh. This is the first uh, I've heard of this. Oh, my apologies. I shouldn't be complaining to my customers. Please, have a look at my wares. Uh, the majority of my business is usually done over in Crossbell, so I even have some Eastern Spices here. Uh, that didn't help me much. This one looks like it might actually be a shop, maybe? It's Merchant Lizzie shop. We'll go to the exchange and we'll sell all of the Seppus masses. It looks like it's a... Uh, is that a 1 for 100 or a 1 for 10? I think it's 1 for 10. Yeah, it says it up top. Exchange. I say I'm, my brain's a little bit tired today. Simple math isn't my thing, but yeah, I figured it out slower than I would have liked. Alright, so we got some things here. Faint, confused. Ooh, that wouldn't be too bad. Ceramic ring for arts attack and arts defense is what I'm assuming. Hmm. I wouldn't necessarily be bad to get a couple of those. How much do we actually have? We have 4,000. I'd like to, to hold off though. Alright. Do we actually get any new equipment? I don't think so. Nope, doesn't look like it. Okay, uh, alright, so we're not gonna do that one. Hello, ma'am. Oh my, how wonderful. Tagging along with my, with father on his boring trip seems to have been worth it after all. There's even jewelry in fur stores too. <laughs> Just where should I spend some money first? I do not know. So this is the renowned Grand Market of Keldrick. It truly does live up to its status as one of Erebonia's most important events. Events? Sure. It's Baron Poe. Visiting such culturally important locations is but one of, of the pleasures I, as a noble, can experience. Yes. Cool, buddy. Appreciate you. Hey there. Sorry, but I'm still setting up shop here. I had a bit of an issue getting stuff sorted out, but it's cool. We have the spot right by the entrance, so I'll give you getting all the customers either way. Well, that's, that's, that's nice to think that way. Hey, girl. Wow, check out all these stalls. Is there more? Is that it? No. Uh, I ended up getting a free book while I was shopping earlier. I've already got too much to carry home as it is, though. Oh, well, it's fine. Here, you can have it. I got the Red Moon Rose Chapter 2. What? Thank you. He'll find a variety of spice-related goods around since we're currently on the spring market. I myself have high-quality lace-based fabrics, cashmere shawls, and all sorts of other things. <laughs> a bit pricey, but don't worry. I won't charge you for window shopping. <laughs> oh, the lace at that stall has a really pretty design. Yeah, it does. I know, I'm, I'm drawn to it too. Ooh, food. Welcome, we've got fresh ham, smoked meat, and sausages here. Ready for you to try. It totally doesn't fit her, but it's fine. Don't pass up on our new service either. 
If you're looking for a full course to take home, then we've got it right here. We'll even throw in a pack of beer, but only if you buy it now. That sounds like something Instructor Sarah would love. No kidding, I can see her spending all her money here. Let's keep quiet about it. Yeah, yeah, I can see that too. Hey, aren't you Farmer Shooty Pants that we uh, had to go and... Let's talk. I'm a farmer, y'all seizes. So I'm here to sell my produce off to one of them there here merchants, you know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Guy's called Limon. And we got a solid business relationship. Nice guy, always getting out freebies and stuff. <laughs> Hello, Squaro. I made plans to buy some rye from a merchant named Amorize. The price of rye is always prone to change at this time of year, though. So here I am, gathering information to make sure I know what sort of deal I'll be getting. Uh-huh. What up? All right, this is Barracks Jewelry Style. We got a cool necklace. What? Prevents burn. Nice. Prevents freeze. Prevents petrify. I'm sure those are all going to be important in time. I don't really like to talk to the shopkeepers, but let's, let's do it this time. Welcome, welcome. We've got jewelry straight from Barriard. Barriard? Barriard? I don't, I don't know. Itself, feast your eyes on these beauties. These were all made over the winter. You're not going to find anything else like them. Uh-huh. Well, that's just fascinating. Mm -hmm. Okay. Uh-oh. Can't let Elliot see. He'll want to go hop in and join. Ooh. Hello. Welcome, welcome. Haha, <laughs> can I interest you in this uh, troubled-looking cat plush? It goes by the name of Mishy, and it's the mascot for a theme park over in Crossbell. You might want to purchase one now if you're interested. They're quite popular and going quickly. A sitting Mishy. Adds defense and speed. Adds HP and defense. And... ADF. Interesting. Because it smells oddly sweet. Then we have the Cobalt Plushie. A plush of a strange yet lovable creature. It's 5 to evasion. That's interesting. Why is... Hmm. I feel like that would be like the, the winner right there. A winner is you. Congratulations. Alright, um... I'm gonna say no for right now. Mishi? I admit it has a certain charm. Does it though? Uh, Tommy's imported goods. The ZCF light prevents blind, gives us some accuracy. The Acrobic Tomato. The Carnelia reprint, chapter one and two. Are the books useful other than just like they're cool? And do we get, um. I wonder if we get something for reading or. We're gonna like have a lot of extra money down the road, or what? Oh ho! There's even some nice septium-based crafts from a uh, liberal here. Li li liberal, liberal. Uh, they're somewhat different than the jewelry and the like made in Bariard. Bariard, Bariard. I, I got nothing. Hee <laughs> hee. Maybe I'll purchase some and pretend I took a leisure trip to liberal, liberal, liberal. The burial grounds. What? Hmm, I wonder what would be a good present for my wife. It's always hard to choose when there's so much available. Uh-huh. Eh, you lot. You wouldn't I happen to be from Tours, would you? Uh, that's correct. Yes, I knew it. My daughter started there this year, too, you see. Ah, 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 her name is Becky. I, I don't know, I'm just gonna go with it. She's a wee cheeky girl whose heed's always thinking about Mira. But well, do try to get along way her if you ever spot her at the academy. Haha, <laughs> will do. Good luck with your sales. What do you sell, my friend? Ooh, ingredientes. Well, you know. 
I'm in the market for some salt. Just saying. And I might be in the market for some eggs, too. There we go. I should be able to buy a bunch of stuff that keeps me from dying, essentially. Now, I don't really have a solution for once I do die, though. That's that's still a problem. Did I? Excuse me. Did I check you out yet? Your honey stall. Oh, okay. Well. Oh, what do we know? We just know the simple omelet. Okay. Hey, old man Flint. Welcome. Anything specific you're looking for? Hmm, this must be the store that Father Zerbel mentioned. We're here on behalf of Father Zerbel, actually. He asked us to come here to collect a bear claw from you. Oh, ho, is that so? Here you go, then. Thank you, sir. I'm surprised at how thorny this is, though, considering it's a medicinal herb. Its resemblance to a bear's claw is where it gets its name from, after all. Unrelated, but my supply of them happens to come from Liberal. They were flown in to Heimdall, where I had them sent along by train. Wow, really? Well, I guess it just goes to show how much of a big deal this market is. Yeah, there really is a bunch of unusual stuff here. The market's popularity is well justified. I believe we've gathered all the ingredients now, correct? Yeah, let's report back to Father Zerbel. All right, well, we've gone through the market. I'm a bit underwhelmed by it, if I'm being honest. Um... I'm gonna go to Odvin's here. Maybe we can get something going on ourselves. We need to talk to him either way. Uh, you know what? We'll, we'll deal with that in a minute. Let's go turn this stuff in. Hopefully we get paid or something. I doubt it, but maybe. Nope, wrong way. Alright. In through the door. What's up, Zerbs? Ah, I see you've returned with the ingredients. We have. Here you are, Father. Bear claw and imperial carrots. Please accepting accepting my thanks now. I uh, accept my thanks now. I can get back to making the medicine. I'd like you to accept these as well as a token of my appreciation. Ooh, Tira balm X3, some celestial balm X3, and oh, thank you, Father. Did you happen to make these as well? That is correct. There's not much of it, but it should come in handy. Thank you for your concern. We'll make good use of these. Good luck with the remainder of your tasks. And may Adios' guidance be with you. Uh, quest for the common cold completed. Oh yeah, we all caught the common cold. What? This is pretty fast on turbo and sprinting. It's a good times. Hold on. Talk to me first, old guy. Oh ho, I take it to your, uh, those students the market manager was talking about. Feel free to take a look at my wares. They may not compare to what you get in bigger smithies, but they should come in handy either way. Okay. Welcome! This is the shop's Orble factory. Oh, you wouldn't happen to be the students from Thor's, would you? What gave it away? My crest and the clear different outfit that I'm wearing? That's correct. We're here in regards to your request. It involved replacing the orbment light in a road lamp on the highway, right? Can we ask for the details? Sure, let's get right to it. As you read, one of the road lamps on the western highway stopped working the other day. And the cause of that is the orbment light inside is breaking. Or it breaking. Okay, so basically I want you to go... I want you all to go to switch the broken orbment light for a new one. Speaking of which, here you go. Thanks. So all that's required of us is to replace a broken one with this then? Yep, that's about the size of it. So where exactly on the western highway is it? Uh, once you're on the highway, keep heading north until you can see a place called Lunaria Nature Park. There's a windmill in front of it that you can't miss. The lamp's near there. Make sure you check the maintenance panel to be sure that it's the right one. It'll have B02 written on it. Near the windmill in front of the nature park. Understood. Is it safe to leave such work in our hands? I believe none of us have any experience related to this. Eh, don't worry. Pretty much anyone can do it. All you're doing is taking the light out and putting the new one in. It's simple. I guess the most difficult thing about it is remembering the code to unlock it. But you can just write that down. There's a code? 
Yeah. You need to input it so you can open the maintenance panel. Let's see here. Code for B02 is 466515. 466515. Got it. Oh yeah, I almost forgot to mention. The light from the road lamps actually repels monsters. So in other words, in places where there's no light, there's much more likely to be monsters. So keep an eye out when you're replacing it. The last thing you want is to be caught off guard by monsters. I see. Thanks for the warning. That's pretty much it, then. Do you mind heading out to do it now? Uh, leave it to us. Let's go, then. Yeah. First try. All right. You. What do you got for me? Oh. Oh, really? We do get new weaponry. Ooh. I'm pretty excited about this. So we're just going to replace our current weapons with this, huh? We have the Kaze Kiri. Interesting. And we'll replace it with the Azuki. And it's a pretty sizable increase, too. About, what, 30 across the board, but we do lose a little bit of agility and a little bit of speed. It's interesting. We lose three speed and we lose five, three agility, I guess. Our agility is 18, but it's also 15 somehow. And our dexterity is zero. I'm very confused. Why do we have a little like bracket with a dexterity? Hmm. Yeah, I guess I'll sure. This is just a straight upgrade. Why, why did Reen get screwed over with his, uh... With his weapon. Alright. It's like Elliot's losing a little bit too. Whoa, your strength is going up, but your arts attack is going down, your speed's going down? I don't know if that's better. Well, I'm gonna take it anyway, but... Uh, I think that's questionable. And yours is a flat upgrade too, with no de oh, no detriment. All right, so we're gonna have to sell some stuff. Oh, let's just sell all of it. Did that give us enough? It did not. Boo. Boo! Hmm. Well, that's unfortunate. Um. Because I would have liked to have gotten a lot more things than just what we have right now. We need 1,040, we only have 880. Alright, well, I guess we're going to go back to the, uh, the place. The West Keldic Highway. We'll get back into doing some battling here. Mm -hmm. So there's the lantern. Let's go the uh, let's go the long way. Surprise! Let's get him. It is our chance. We got that advantage. Alright, so here we're going to have to end up using a little bit of our EP, which we never recovered any from, interestingly enough. Which I feel is a little bit of a oversight, maybe? On my part, but we'll make do. I mean, we, we've got potions and things that we can do if we need to. Just straight up landing it, huh? Alright. What if I hit you with, like, a flamberge? Turn to flames. That's probably still going to hit relatively Burn. hard, right? Oh, it did not. Okay. Right. It paralyzed it, though, oddly enough. My turn. Alright, let's go with Firebolt. You got all crazy-eyed. Like, Alright, Arts again, Needle. Arcus, activate. Arcus, huh. activate. Form of, you done got got. Okay, it's safe for now. Woohoo! Yeah! I can't tell if my weapon changed at all. I don't think so. 
like the appearance? I don't think it changed. Bad bird. Now's our chance. Ha! Huh. I can do this. We're still linked up. Go. Good day. Right. Did you just say Gaga? My End it. Hey. Here we go. You suck. All right. Let's try this again. Yeah. I've got you. Very nice. Flump. Not enough. My turn. Yeah. Still nothing. Here we go. They just refuse to like work together, you know. chance. All right. So we got double assists going here. Probably finish off this birdie bird. Oh, we missed. Of course we did. Why am I surprised by any of this? Okay. Apparently it's just a super dodgy bird. My turn. Ha! Rain power! Okay, it's safe for now. Alright, super close to level 10 on Rain. I did not find any place that sold uh, potions. Which I was kinda hoping to do. That way I could get myself um some extra resurrection stuff. I'd like to try to sneak up on this, I just don't think it's possible. Now's our chance. Oh, I didn't hit him 100%. I stunned him, but I didn't fully full out clear him. Alright, this is fine. Get him. I've got you. I can do this. Okay, how about we hit you with a flamber? Here. Hold my arrow that's on fire. It's named turn. after a large sword. That's logic. That dog my might turn. just burn out. Hey. My turn. I'm gonna say doggo's gonna burn out. We'll see. My turn. Oh, never mind. He uh, it switched my, targets on my. me, which is fine. It's my turn. Alyssa says good day, sir. Good job, Alyssa. All right, level ten for Reen. I did it. I also wanted to check out the Orbal Factory, and I forgot to, because I wanted to go get that little bit of extra money, a little bit of extra Mira to come back and, and get her sword upgrade. And I was like, well, I mean, we can go back to this area. We're relatively strong compared to where we were when we originally started fighting these things. So I figured maybe we'd be okay. All right, let's do this thing. My turn. You're gonna start off with an art, actually. Arcus, activate. Arcus, right. activate. Form of a water buffalo. Fire! Boo! Now. I got gotcha. you. Of course. All right, I want you to craft it up with an earth cleaver. There it is. Ah, overhead chop. My turn. You hit this guy. <laughs> Needle shoot. Hopefully the other one did a little bit of Oh yeah, we, we murdered turn. it. Straight up annihilated. Yeah. I find an Alyssa being go. a little underwhelming overall, to be honest. It's all good though. Yeah. Let's go. And oh, there we go. Critical hit with a follow-up. Very nice. <laughs> you fought well, Ellie. Oh. It's all I can do to keep up with you. Yeah. Oh, Ellie getting some love. What? Good job, Elliot. Andy leveled up too. All right. You get anything new, buddy? No, he didn't get anything new. It's fine. Ooh, stuff fell out. Insulating tape. Uh... I think I went, I went too far. It's the windmill over here. There it is. I see it. Solves it. It's kind of a bird brain bird right there. 
We're all up in his Kool-Aid, all up in his business. Wow, he's, he's by himself. I, can do I sort of feel bad for him. Of course. As Laura slices him in half. We should keep going. Swift and yeah. Is this the one? It's supposed to be near the windmill in front of the nature park, right? Mm, this light doesn't appear to be working, which means that's probably the one Samus was referring to. Probably. Let's check the number on it. B02. Yep, this is the one. Alright, we must enter the code. After taking care of our uninvited guests. What? Monsters. Oh, oh look at them. Sure are a lot of them. This is lights really work. We need to change that thing quick. Rain, can we trust the task itself to you? Sure thing. The rest of you keep the monsters at bay while I make the switch. You can count on us! This seems like a bad plan. Okay, first things first, I need to input the code to open the maintenance hatch. Pretty sure it was... Uh, this one. 466515. Should do it. It opened! Now let's get the new orbit light in place. Don't you need to take the old one out first? Oh, well that was... Cool. Thank you so much for your help. Looks like things have finally calmed down. Thankfully, hard to believe much of a difference, or how much of a difference those things make. You got that done in record time, Reen. Yeah, I was expecting the process to take much longer. Well, it was a pretty simple procedure, since I wasn't being har harangued nice, by the monsters the whole time anyway. <laughs> Still, good job. And I guess that's a wrap. Yeah, now we just need to report back to Samus. Alright. Sounds like a plan. Let's go fight the, the bouncy fox owls here. Ha! Raccoon owls? I don't know what they There's are. A chance. Let's get them. Yeah. My turn. My turn. Get crit. I got you. Shouldn't she have crit too? Fire. Now. She got pierced. It. Well, we got through it. My turn. Ha. <laughs> ah. Don't worry, Reen to save the day. Okay, there it is. Safe for now. Boom. I'd like to let the girls catch up to level 10, if I could. Of the lasses, as it were. Well, I mean, we have to make our way back, so... Might as well do so. Um... Oh! <laughs> Come on, then! Go! Well, that's not great. Um... <laughs> right. Wow, we just flat out obliterated that. They really don't like our, our guy there. It's my turn. They are very anti him. I said we go arts and we do um golden sphere. Actually he doesn't like fire. Let's go with the heat wave. I don't know that we've used that yet. It's gonna be basically all of her EP. Right. And then we're gonna craft it out with some resounding beats. Keep it up, everyone. Huh? Did a, over a thousand. Wow. Yeah, it still wasn't quite enough to kill. <laughs> Woo! That was close. Let's put this guy down. We'll cut our own path. Yeah, path cutting. It's what we do. Alright. Well, I wasn't a big fan of the bug coming and running out of nowhere and attacking me, but... Eh, it happened. Sit. Now's our chance. We can do this. Ooh, there's a lot here. My turn. Alright, gonna art it up. Arcus, activate. It's my turn. Hmm... I'm gonna use my blessed arrow. You have my face. Gonna plop that on down. It's our boy's turn. Uh, you know what? 
Let's go with the craft. Let's go with the. Uh... Yeah, let's go with the resounding beat. Keep that should up, be everyone. fine. There it is. Well, I'm curious as to whether the Earth Cleaver works or not. Oh, it does. Cool. Okay, that's one less. There we go. Didn't do a tremendous amount, but it did something. Stepping up, taking that shot. I guess we just obl obliterate whoever's in front of us. Right. Hey. Probably could have Go. moved to rearrange myself a little bit there. Hmm. Guess we'll go with the needle shoot again. Arcus, activate. On this Major. guy. I guess I'm going Flamberge. It's Here's not going to do much. Oddly, it's not going to do much. Burn. You'd think that would still hurt it, but apparently it's more of a physical attack than a magic Light attack. Turn. Don't worry, he's got it. Or at least a close facsimile of, of godding it. Uh. Off guard. Really? Oh, that's up. awesome. Cool. We off-guarded it. Unscathed. You yeah. fought well, Ellie. It's all I can do to keep up with you. That's right. You did fight well, buddy. We appreciate you, man. Come on, Bugling. Turn the other way. Bring it on. Oh, that's not good. My turn. Hmm. I'm gonna say. Fire's your weakness. I'm gonna put one of you down then. We're gonna resound our beat once more. All are healed and defended. Right. Going after the big boy. Nice. Alright, she's ready with her superpower thing. We may or may not need it. I'm not positive at this point. Just sneaks right on in there, man. I'm gonna say we go craft, we go blessed arrow. Let's keep our boys up. Hang in there. Hey there, guys. Healing's on its way. You have my thanks. And some extra CP coming at you too. All right, we're going to take care of these two. Yeah. Radiant Blade Dance. Very nice. Here we go. All right, let's finish this up. Right. And oh, really? You're gonna get another attack off? I can do we this. said good day, sir. <laughs> Is everyone okay? Well done. All right. One or two more battles and we'll actually have it. I'm gonna go until we hit level 10 and then we'll break off the uh, the episode, guys and girls. Hopefully you guys are cool with that. We got an S tablet. Ooh. And some cooling spray. I'm gonna take care of the bird and I'm gonna backtrack and deal with the other thing. Well, shall we begin? Well, that didn't work. It's my turn. Nice. Unexpected, but very nice. Uh, zero arts. Okay. Very good. Uh, taking them down. Bye. My turn. Your turn indeed. Go for it. Not quite enough. The other one's paralyzed, can't do anything. Hold this. Don't worry, we're coming at you double team styles with a Z. And bam. Just double teaming left, right, and center, man. That was that was great. 
Nicely done, Elisa. Same to you. That was All right. great. Level 10 across the board. Perfect. Nicely done. Very good. <laughs> Not bad. Very nice. Very nice. Alright, so we are going to run back. We'll bypass this battle then. And in the next episode, ladies and gentlemen, we will be turning in our quest. We'll be going to the Orbital Factory and dealing with that whole chicanery. All that is that. Um, this is random houses and stuff too. Uh, so we're just going to go over to where we need to be for this. Which, if I'm not wrong, is right here. Alright, and with that, ladies and gentlemen, it's going to do it for this episode. I really hope you enjoyed. We got a lot of combat in there. Uh, well, a decent amount of combat in there. We got to finish up two quests, basically, and we have one left to do before we move on with the rest of this chapter, or the end of this chapter, at the end of the field study, and then I guess we're going to return back to the Academy. So, we'll see how that all plays. Till the very next episode, I've been your host, Bumpy McSquiggums. Thank you so much for stopping by the Freak Show. And always remember, we play, we fight, we conquer.